Good morning. I just wanted to invite you into my home for morning meditations. We'll be doing it on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. I want to encourage our church people during this time to um, take the book of Proverbs and read one chapter a morning. We'll be doing that for the month of April, and uh, then we'll be moving to Psalms for the month of May if this continues. Uh, I just want to read a few verses for us this morning. Proverbs chapter 1 says, To give subtility to the simple, to the young man knowledge and discretion. A wise man will hear and will increase learning, and a man of understanding shall attain to wise counsel. To understand a proverb and the interpretation, the words of the wise and their dark saying. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. My son, hear the instruction of thy father, and forsake not the law of thy mother. For they shall be an ornament of grace unto thy head, and chains about thy neck. My son, if sinners entice thee, consent thou not. I want to encourage you to read the entire chapter of uh, Proverbs 1. But I want to give you a few thoughts today uh, as our opening morning meditation. Number one, I realize that this is a, a time of change and upheaval, but don't get off schedule. Read your Bible, pray, find a hymn for the day to sing. Uh, the Bible tells us that uh, if we're going to be filled with the Spirit, one of the manifestations of that is psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs, making melody in your heart to the Lord. That doesn't sound like someone living in fear or depression. Uh, be careful during this time. Boy, it seems like when we get off schedule, uh, many times we uh, tend to uh, give in to uh, sinful temptations or even depression, uh, different things get our attention. I want to encourage you today. Uh, take the Word of God. Encourage yourself with it. Grow thereby. Boy, get a hymn and sing the praises of God. Let's pray this morning. Dear Lord, thank you for today. I thank you for our church family in the Pioneer Valley. I pray you would bless everyone, protect them, guide and direct them, Help each one of us to stay on schedule. Help us to get busy serving you. Help us not to allow uh, the things of this world uh, to get our attention, but help us to focus on you and walk with you during these days. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you. We love you, and I hope you have a great day.